How bright is this light? Or this light? Or this light? I'll get the measurements when I unbox and test this light meter out. I use a lot of lights when I'm shooting for Thrifty AV, so I wanted something where I could measure the intensity of those lights, so I purchased this Ursary light meter model MT912 on Amazon. I'm going to unbox this and see what we got here. Try it out. Here's the box. I believe it's pronounced Ursary light meter. It's going to open from the top, I believe. Bubble wrap. Three AAA batteries. Serial number. Ursary warranty card. Spark your creativity. Dear valued customer, thank you for choosing Ursary. We hope you enjoy using the convenience, quality, and affordability of your Ursary products. If you feel satisfied on our products, feel free to leave us an unbiased review and share your experience to help us improve our products, also helping others' customers. If any problem occurs, please reach out to our customer support via email, Facebook, or through the Usury official stores you use to purchase your item. Amazon, AliExpress, Wish, eBay, and more. Email address, Facebook. We always work hard to serve you and provide you a better customer experience. I didn't see anywhere on it what the warranty is. Let's look at back here. Measuring range 0 to 200,000 lux are foot candles, up to 20,000 foot candles. Temperature negative 20 Celsius to 70 Celsius. Sampling rate, two times per second. Runs on three triple A's, 60 hour battery life. Actually came with some batteries, that's nice. Factory, the address of the factory, it's Chinese. Made in China. Ah, here's the booklet. User manual for the MT-912. Six languages. Pages one through five is English. High accuracy, fast respond, temperature measurement, enable, disable, auto power off. Max min record. Data hold. I'm going to be using that. Color LCD display with backlight. Automatic measurement, low battery. I can pick between lux or foot candles. Resolution, accuracy, photo detector, LCD display, hold button, max min button, battery cover, nameplate. And it's already calibrated. Here's the warranty, 12 months. Let's install the batteries. That's in Lux. That's in Foot Candles. I'm going to do a candle at one feet and see if I get one foot candle. And then there's Hold. I'm going to be using that. So right now it's picking up the kitchen lights. So the kitchen lights are about 270 Lux. Now let's turn on these. I'm holding the light meter about a foot away from this 21 watt shop light. I'm going to hit hold and the display is 
5,372 lux, which is, oh, it won't go to foot candles while it's on hold. We're on foot candles now. I'm still holding it about a foot away. And then I'm hitting freeze. 487.3 foot candles. Now let's compare that to this light. We'll leave it on foot candles. This one is 1,258 foot candles a foot away. So this one is considerably brighter. It's about 1 p.m. on a partly cloudy day. Uh, 4,706 foot candles. The sun is peeking through the clouds now. And we have 4,904 foot candles. Switching to Lux, when the clouds are out, it's around 39.8. All right, the sun is getting out from behind the clouds and is creeping up. For the next part of this video, I've taken a CFL light bulb outside. I have a tape measure attached to it, and I have the light meter set to foot candles because I'm gonna be measuring distances in feet. And I'm gonna log the measurements as I get further and further away from this light. So let's start at one foot away from this light. And it is 56.5 foot candles. All right, now I'm gonna go two feet away from the light. It is now 17.1 foot candles. Now I'm gonna go three feet away from the light. At three feet away from the light, I have 7.5 foot candles. At four feet away from the light, I have 4.2 foot candles. At five feet away from the light, I have 2.5 foot candles. At six feet away from the light, I have 1.7 foot candles. I'm gonna go ahead and take it to nine feet next. At nine feet away from the light, I have 0.7 foot candles. At 16 feet away from the light, it was too dim for this light meter. I'm gonna to have to stop there. I've come back in the house to measure the light intensity of a votive candle. My excuse is this way I avoid wind, but the real reason, this way I avoid mosquitoes. The candela unit is no longer based on candles, and even when it was, it was not based on votive candles, but I still thought it would be interesting to see what the light output of a votive candle is. At six inches away, I get 1.1. At eight inches away, I get 0.6. At 12 inches away, I'm getting 0.2. So 0.2 foot candles for a votive candle one foot away. And I lost my focus. Well, the Urshery light meter is a cool little toy. It doesn't have the sensitivity or features of a professional unit, but it doesn't have the cost of a professional unit either. If you enjoyed this video or any other in the Thrifty AV series, please like and subscribe. I'd like to give a shout out to MyCurveFit.com for providing a useful utility for plotting my data points. And thank you to my patrons for supporting Thrifty AV. Stay thrifty, everyone.